the disadvantages, okay? financial restrictions, there's no equity, you're not obtaining an asset. It's not like you're buying a house and you're obtaining the asset of the house. All right. You also don't receive tax benefits because you're not a homeowner. You have lifestyle restrictions. So in your lease, your landlord may say there's no pets, no dogs. That may, there's also limitations on what you can do inside. You can't just go ahead and paint the walls a different color because you don't like the walls. You can't go ahead and change the carpet to wood floors because it's not yours. There are also legal, matter, legal matters. You sign a lease when you rent. And a lease is a document that defines the conditions of the rental agreement be between yourself, your the tenant, and the landlord. All right? You need to go through that lease very carefully. If there's nothing, is there something that you don't understand, speak it out with your landlord. If there's an issue that you like to have changed in the lease, you need to figure that out and discuss before you sign it. Okay? Because so, you are binded by that lease. And the biggest thing is privacy. You really have no privacy in an apartment because you have people living on top of you, right next to you. So it's it's harder as compared to living in a, in a house when you have your own space that you own. 